Hey guys, welcome back to the channel and today after a long time we are going to do a unboxing and a first look. So today we are gonna unbox the not unbox actually re-unbox my new gaming beast. So without any delay, let's get started. As you can see that I have already applied a skin on this laptop, it's a custom skin. If you want to buy this skin then you can check the link in the description. You can customize it as your choice. Talking about the build and design, towards the left you get a HDMI and a power connector with an exhaust fan. Towards the right you get a headphone jack, two USB 3.2 A type. Then followed by two USB-C type 3.2 generation I think, I will have to check it again. And an Ethernet port with a Kensington lock. Talking about the back side, you get a very ventilated option here. The build is good, it's plastic though, but it's sturdy. Talking about the lid. You can easily open it by one hand. There is very little flex, not too much. The lid opening and closing is very smooth. You do get a single light keyboard that is in red color. And the boot times are pretty good. Now at many times what happens that you get a screen bleeding issue with high refresh rate panels on laptops but that is not our case with this laptop I did not notice any kind of screen bleed the screen brightness levels are very good and definitely better than what I get with the Lenovo Flex 5 talking about some of the hardware features it comes with the Intel's i7 9th generation H series processor it comes with dual channel 2600 MHz 16 GB RAM preloaded. The speeds are not as high as what I get with my Lenovo Flex 5. It has 3200 MHz. But I did not notice any difference in the daily use. Now the thing that makes this laptop beast is the RTX 2060. Talking about overclocking properties. You can use the MSI Dragon Center to overclock the CPU and the GPU speeds and switch the profiles and many things. So guys that's it for this video and I will drop a review of this laptop soon. Okay guys thanks for watching. I hope to see you soon.